Hi, I'm Allison from ACMC's Wellness Kitchen. We have already had great fun before we even started and came on live. So we are here from um, ACMC's Wellness Kitchen, like I said. We are with Jim from Hi. Sunrise Live. It's nice to have you on our side this time. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not nervous or anything. We're <laughs> Glad to be here. Thank you for inviting, inviting That's me. That's the kind of show. Am I looking the right be. direction here? Whatever. You can look wherever you want to. You and everybody knows John. John's on with us again. John's usually behind the camera, and I know everybody knows that. So this is the third time we've roped you in. Second or third time. Second. Okay, I can tell right now you're hard up today. <laughs> 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 it's pretty rough. But we're going to do um, our best. Okay. Yeah. Listen, uh, we're hoping that we can get some decent food out. Yeah. As we entertain you today, okay. that's our goal. All right. All right. All right. Well, and normally you guys always do uh, like a, a lunch or an appetizer or a dessert or a smoothie or something like sure. that. Sure. But we, it, because Jim's here, Sunrise Live, we've got something special planned, right? Absolutely. We're doing breakfast with Jim from Sunrise Live. That's perfect. That's Thank perfect. you. Absolutely. So our goal is when you're watching Jim on Conneaut, um in Conneaut Live. Yeah. Make some breakfast. We have some really healthy, simple things. You can even make the eggs the night before, so that way you don't miss anything. You're well, not in the kitchen. Bingo. That's right. You but can heat it up and you, eat it. The I'm sorry to interrupt. You yeah. have a TV in your kitchen, so you can watch while you're standing there cooking. I don't have a TV. I, I thought you had a TV. No, never mind. No, I, but that's an on. idea, though. I you got to keep us on track here, Jim. I'm already going to see where this is heading. So. <laughs> do, you, do you have a TV in your kitchen? Let's get to the bottom. Of this. Does anybody have a TV? No, in their kitchen? and don't let my so. wife. If you see this, because if she sees me cooking in the kitchen, I'll have a new job at the house. Oh, so let's keep this quiet. There'll be expectations. But you know what? I do watch your wellness kitchen, and you make things that are very easy and yet healthy to make, but they're easy. Yes. And even for a guy like me, this I can probably get through this today. I'm looking forward to this. We're hoping. And you know what? The thing of it is, is we always say things we try to make healthy, um, but... There are times when we splurge a little. This is all basically pretty healthy. Yeah. Um, we don't have anything this time me. that we're splurging on. So this is a nice, healthy breakfast. What are we splurging on? A couple of allergy issues, possibly. But okay. people, people that know they have allergies, just you can uh, adapt the recipe or uh, don't make what we're making. Sure. That's true. And that's why we've done three different things here. Because oh, okay. we have two with peanut butter. There are peanut butter allergies. Mm -hmm. So we've decided to do an egg um, with some really great stuff I'm in there. I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, I am I, too. I, I am too. So we're going to get started on the um, the little egg bakes. And what we do oh. is really simple. Is we're going to have you mix this up for us, Jim, if you don't mind. I get to whisk you away. You get to whisk away. All right. Want me to start? Am I supposed to be starting? Yes, yes you go right ahead. the eggs in the in the bowl, please. Yes. Uh, so look at how experienced that, I am with this. What am I doing? That, that one went up. Like a, <laughs> yeah, that one went up on the edge. Al Roker, where are you? Yeah. <laughs> I need your buddy. Doesn't Al Roker taste everything on the on the? I think plate? he used to do stuff. He's too big for that now. I don't know what he's doing. <laughs> Hey, I'm doing, they're getting together. You are doing yeah. a fantastic job. Look at how well this is. Thank you. So what I'm tired. doing is I'm just adding a little bit of salt, a little bit of peppers. Are you guys okay with garlic? Absolutely. All right. We're going to do a little bit of garlic in there. Allison. <laughs> <laughs> garlic. And how about some Italian seasoning for both of you? Why are you not? The Super Mario so, Brothers comes out today. You know what? I'm going to tell you Italian seasoning and eggs don't go over for everybody. But it is delicious when you do it in a, in a little bit of an egg bake. All right. Throw that in there. Look at that. All right. Oh, we'll just do a little oh, oh. bit just for you guys. There we have seasoned tomatoes also, right? So yeah. we don't want to overdo too much here. And that's exactly but, but why you I'm just season doing a every bit. step along the way. You don't just wait and throw it all in. Hey, guys, those. I think I got these whisked pretty well. You know what? We're proud. Yeah, you did fantastic. Honey, looking. I can do this. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we weren't going to tell her. That's right. <laughs> now, what do we do at this point? So what we're going to do. That looks good already. It does. So what we're going to oh, do I is see. we're going to spoon a little bit in each of these. So you can have... So you got like a six-thing muffin tin with the papers in them. Absolutely. Perfect. Absolutely. So everybody gets a little egg bake, and oh. you get to add whatever you want to add. I so get it. So if you and John would like to cut up some peppers for us I'm while we're doing this... I'm going to a sharp instrument. We are. I'm going to oh, pass Lord. it to you. You right. did fantastic. How little do we want here? You know what? Just bite size in this little... Bite size. Okay. Yep. Real little bite size. And you know what? You don't like peppers. Don't add them. You, you really like... Ah! I think I need, to run, over, I think I need to run over to the hospital. <laughs> I'm just scaring it a little bit. You gotta add some spice up to this show. All yeah. Right. The sad thing is, he did that right when I got my fingernails. I'm so sorry, I John. Was like, oh. oh, Jennifer's gonna get me now. Um, 
Honey, I don't know how to do this. Okay, I'll take care of it. Not anymore. Not anymore, <laughs> Jennifer. I'm this really isn't you. that hard. I hate to say that. It's you not. want the whole thing cut or no, just a little bit? No, just that little bit and we'll be right. fine. Well, these look good. Now, a little smaller or are these okay? You what are you what? thinking? If they're, if they're perfect, just actually the size is really good. What about that? Okay. Because then we can throw them in and they're bite size. Now, how many are we going to put the peppers in? How many want peppers out of six? I'm going to do peppers. Would yeah, you like some peppers? peppers? Yeah, Would you like absolutely. some? Yeah. You, these two drop are yours. You can oh, go I'll do some pepper. There. Do I get the ones on the end there? You know what? This one has a lot of egg, John. So you okay. do that one and that one and I'll do the top because okay. I'll just make a little bit for myself. Ooh, I'll take a little bit. Okay, a little bit of the red. Oh, yeah, yeah, red's good. Yep, I Thank put you. a little there red in each of mine, and I'm going to put a little bit yeah. of Go this right in. Ahead. Sorry, I'm reaching in. Sure. Sure. I'll hand that over to you. I'll take a little bit right. and a little bit. All right. Now, that's kind of cool how this works. Absolutely. So now we have some onions. I was going to get leeks, but I'm telling you, leeks, where you want to chop up a little bit of those? Sure. Okay. Leeks were extremely expensive, and I'm very frugal. And so I thought, you know what, this time I'm going to pass on the leeks because they didn't look really that great for the price that they had. Mm. So I just ended up doing um, the bunching onions, which I really like. And I chop them up really fine to get them in here. Some people like the whites of the bunching onions Don't in watch there. This. There's Al Roker. Oh. <laughs> now, more or less? You know is that what? A good the, this little bit of pepper here, the way that's cut up real small, you just throw them in there. Oh, look at that. And, a little bit there. Yeah, a little bit in there. And sometimes, okay. like I said, some people like the whites of the onions or the greens of the onions. Did it's you whatever. Want you want. I didn't cut that enough. That's okay. okay. John got his over there. We're perfect. So then you can add a little bit of that. And honestly, just make what you want. Some people cut up ham. They put ham in there. Oh, Some oh. people cut up sausage or bacon, depending on what you want or how healthy you want to make this. But one of my favorite, favorite, favorite things to add into this is Italian seasoned. It's basil, garlic, um, Italian seasoned diced tomatoes. Ooh. I open up the can. I throw them in there, and it makes it absolutely delicious. You go right in. So, and do that. You, would you like some in yours? I'm gonna leave the tomato out of mine for now. Just to show you, I can leave them out. It's right. Still works. Absolutely. Yeah. So we're gonna That's do good. a couple in yeah. there. I just want to order. It's kind of put whatever yep. works for you in these things. Whatever you that. like. That is neat. You know what? And this is so healthy. It's so healthy. We didn't use any oils or any sprays or anything. We just used the the paper. Put it in there, and we're going to cook it, and we're ready right. to go. So if you gentlemen would like to get started on the next, I'll put this in here. John will swap right. spots. You go right. right ahead. Oh, cool. Yeah, we're All right, it right looks here. good, looks good. All right, Jim, so we're, we're trying to get this water boiling, and it's not quite there yet. Uh -oh. So uh, so while we wait for water to boil, here we go. <laughs> so I'm watching so, paint dry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, you're on every morning. From what, what times are you on? 7.30 to 10, Monday to Friday. Okay. 7.30 uh, to 10. 7.30 in okay. the morning, yeah. All right. Uh, right out of the Conneaut Studios there. We're, most people right now have been watching us on cable television. If you have Great Wave, it's on Channel 6. Okay. If you have Spectrum, it's 10.24. And in the month of March, we introduced a brand new app that for Conneaut residents, if they get this, they see me. I have my own channel my head hasn't exploded or anything yet. My own channel on our network that we show, I'm on channel one. Oh, nice. Morning, so I was live with Jim. Very nice. All right. So this is Very the last nice. thing you'll get me here without my usual fee going forward. So. <laughs> <laughs> but that's how they see us every day. Okay, so yeah. that, that's Conneaut, Kingsville, part of Ashtabula. Yeah, a little bit. For, cable, for mm -hmm. the cable side, just Conneaut. For right the... now for the app. Okay. Now, someday, who knows, but for right now, they're experimenting it in Conneaut, and there's been a lot of takers so far, so Good. it's going well. Fantastic. Good. Now, people can also see you. You guys record some of those segments, and, and they're on Good Great point. Ways. Uh, uh, web website, right? I or do this, on Vimeo. This is what we do on my site on Facebook, which is Sunrise Live with Jim. You can find my page very easily. What we do there is a few different interviews in the week. It's a live show in the morning. Most things are just live and then they're done. I have a guy come in from the Conneaut Cable Board who records some of the segments that I think they're all good, but I mean, I can only do so many. I have a few of them recorded each week, and then they show up. There's a cable lineup. On our cable channels that plays after my shows over all day and all night local Conneaut Ashtabula County stuff that is on cable and then I have a little Vimeo link on my page where you can just go see the direct video some of them are mine some of them are other interviews with other people in town and there's just a lot of interesting stuff there what 
Nice, yeah. really nice. And, and people may wonder, well, why are we talking about cable TV in the yeah. hospital? Well, Allison, we have a connection with Jim uh, twice a month, right? Absolutely. Dr. Williams comes on. Um, my Conneaut Family Health Center. Absolutely. Dr. Williams and Conneaut. She's, uh, she's primary care, sees patients out there. Um, I was introduced to Jim when, um, I believe it was when I first came down to business development. They said, hey, you're doing an event. We need you to go talk to Jim and go right go Jim. Out Live, yeah, live TV. I, I think I broke out in a sweat. I was like, oh my gosh, no. So I went on. I was so nervous, so very, very nervous. Everybody kept saying, Jim's such a nice guy. He'll talk with you. You'll have a I great time. I with the rest of them. You did fantastic. I was like, oh, wow, that was kind of fun. So now... Every time I go on and I to Sunrise Live and I talk with Jim, one of the things I say is every time one of the physicians are coming out to see you, how nervous they are. Is I'm gonna be I kinda like me. that. I hate to yeah. say that I'm evil Jim. Because it's like they're always, you know, their element and they know way more than I do, but when they come into my realm, it's they, like and there's nothing to be scared of, but it's a different venue for them. Right. So right. I get it. Well, here's one of the things on live TV that yeah. we, we didn't do. What didn't we do? These things right here were for the egg bake. Uh oh. If you Wanted to put spinach or broccoli or cauliflower. Yeah, that could have gone in. That could have gone in the egg bake. So <laughs> that would have been really good. That would have been really good in the egg bake. But we we missed that one. So we get spinach leaves. Yeah, look at so, all that. You know, I, I normally will put a little bit of Italian seasoning with the the spinach and the tomatoes okay. in my egg bake, and it's a little Italian egg bake. It, to me, it's fantastic. So, so, so you could make a little salad or something to go with veggie salad to go with this. To go with, mm. yeah, absolutely. Delicious. So I'm going to make that up. drink. We could grill those up on the on the stove and have a little side to that. Sure. We'll throw some spices it's on there. It's bubbling a little bit. Sure. Throw a little bit of little sriracha bit. on there or something to make it a little hot if you want spicy uh, veggies to go with your eggs. Absolutely. So well, what we're going to do next mm -hmm. is our oats uh -huh. that oh. John have. They call for two uh, two bananas. Two bananas. Thanks, John, for helping me out. We're going to get these bananas cut up. I'm going to let you gentlemen do that while I clean up our, our, oh, our cutting boards. Yeah, I'll clean up our cutting oh, boards and, okay. and let you guys cut up those. We do not want onions in the oatmeal. And we do not want any of the no. eggs. So, Jim, I know also you are, not only do you talk about the local stuff, mm -hmm. but you guys also, every once in a while, will have folks on to talk about movies and entertainment and things like that. Yeah, we are, and, and the, it's funny, Sunrise Live, I will talk with about anybody in the county in general. I have politicians sometimes, teachers, right. principals, uh, superintendents of school systems, our auditor of the county comes on once in a while. I have the commissioners on. I'll have a man or woman who uh, just maybe started a business in county or in the county and they want to come on and talk about their business. Mm -hmm. We will do about anything, any topic that's of interest to the general public on Sunrise Life. Okay, well, this this recipe actually goes along with the movie folks that you talk to. Because, oh. Uh, because you have some of your friends on. You guys talk about different movies. Okay, yes, I do. Uh, so this relates to Elvis movies. Oh. So what is Elvis's favorite sandwich? Do you remember? Peanut butter and banana. That's right. <laughs> Peanut butter and banana. So Thank you very much. This is, so we're calling this Elvis oatmeal. Oh, or another way, Elvis oatmeal. Elvis oatmeal, baby. <laughs> so this is, and you gotta get your fingers right. You know, okay. Then right. we got the water bowl over here. We got the oats. We got the banana. We're gonna put it all together with some peanut butter. We're gonna make peanut butter and banana oatmeal. Oh, oh, that's not bad. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah. So for health wise, no, don't step on my blue suede shoes. That's, that's it. That's Carl Perkins. Now he did blue suede shoes. He did a Carl Perkins. Yeah, Carl a Perkins. cover. Oh. A cover. Yeah, it's Carl Perkins. Let's get Memphis music right, okay? We're gonna get it. Let's do it right. Sun Studios. Yeah. Right. So no, the, the good thing about this, it's got a lot of protein in it. Okay. It's got a little bit of sweetener in it, so there's that that sweet flavor. It's got the nuts. It's got the the peanut butter. It's got the banana. Uh, overall, it's about thirty to forty grams of protein mm. in the oatmeal. It's your it's your grains for the day. You can use rolled oats. You can use the uh, Scottish or Irish oats if you want a little bit of that extra okay. uh, oaty goodness in it. And so it's and it's very simple to make. And basically, you're making oatmeal, but the topping is what gives it that flavor. But I had never heard of peanut butter and banana oatmeal. No. And I thought this would be really good because a lot of times, you know, we, we don't want to get up in the morning and have the toast and the bread and things like that. We want to eat healthy. So this is a good way to do it. And, and Ben Miola, on, when we were at one of the events with, with, with him, he was talking about eat oatmeal, but eat it in smaller portions or, or just have it for breakfast, things like okay. that. But he was talking about the health benefits of oatmeal. Sure. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, so that's almost fully boiled. 
But, it's getting uh, there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get this so chopped up. Yeah, let's, chop yeah, up. Let's, uh, yeah, keep going there. I, I quit. I didn't do any chopping. Look at this. Oh, wow. Wow. I was now, real small or just leaving chunks like that? How do you, you like want? That. That's okay. Yeah. That's good enough, yeah. yeah what that, 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 that line up. Don't watch. Watch. Oh, that is good. <laughs> Is that, a, is that a good ripe banana? Try it. Try it. It's good. Yeah. It's not bad. See, this is what I do when I cook. I sit around and I'm, I'm around around by the time I get to dinner, I'm not hungry. What level yeah. chef would you call yourself? How, can you make really weird stuff? Or I just would the be, basics. I would be eliminated in the first round of any cooking show. But I would be on <laughs> the cooking show. I think I could be on the cooking show. I cook all the time. Okay. Uh, I get home before my wife. Yeah. And a lot of times, and, and cooking for me is stress relief. Oh, you enjoy Strangely it? Strangely enough. Yeah, if I've had a, that. yeah, if I've had a really rough day, it's still creative, which yeah. I need that release. But just getting together and making, I, I, I'll look at four or five recipes and put it together. But again, it's that it's it's creative, but it's out of out of normally what I do. This, that, I, I'm not one to go out and and you know go running for ten miles to okay. get that, get everything out of my head. And I wish I was because you get obviously the chef's I need some, eye, not yeah. the runner's eye. <laughs> right, exactly. So when I get a when I get a good meal, and my wife says, "Man, that was a, that was excellent." Then I, I'm, and I always have the, the way I judge this is I say, what would you pay for that in a restaurant? And she and if she goes four ninety nine. Then I know that's she's not just so happy meal. Forget yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She's like, I wouldn't order that in a restaurant. But you know, she's like, oh, that's a twelve twenty feet. You know, favorite third, yeah. you like to make that you know comes out well every time. What do you like to make? I, I like um, right now. I'm on a on a kick of doing uh, chicken and vegetables and gravy. Like a, a cream sauce mm -hmm. or something like that, because you've got the health, uh, the healthy of the chicken. You've got that flavor mm -hmm. of the, you know. They I can taste it already. So yeah. <laughs> so we're not making that today, obviously. But, but have you done this thing we're doing today? You've done this before. No. This is new to you this too. This is new to me. All right. We but, we but, but make it all new. I, I'm okay. gonna be honest with you. Oatmeal is hard to screw up. Not true. Now That's that it. I've said that, you know, the only thing we're waiting for is it's almost to boiling. Um, almost there. Yeah. Where the uh, bananas are people. ready, yeah. condiments are ready. Other so stuff. we're gonna we're gonna hold off on this, yeah. and wait for that oatmeal sure. to cook. And in the meantime, I'll we're gonna go ahead. You, yeah. And what are we doing here? We, these are breakfast energy bars. Oh yeah, I've been waiting. Yeah, I've been yeah. to try these. So. so we there's roasted assorted nuts. There's four cups in here, and actually we just lay it down. You take your rolling pin over it, and you just Good. kind of break them up a little bit. Okay. Yeah. So we have the four cups. I, I just remembered something, Jim. Yeah. There's another way people can see you. Okay. In the community, you do a little bit outside of television. So anyway, <laughs> back to this uh, four cups. Oh, no, 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 no. We, we've got this going now. You, 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 were, you were in a play earlier in the year, correct? Christmas late, 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 yeah, late last year. Oh, what play? You didn't tell her. I didn't Thank tell her, you. Yeah, I didn't tell her the play. Oh, I get into this little A-Bop theater they do in Conneaut once in a while. Well, no, my first time was in December. They okay. Go, you need to do this. I go, nah, I'm not interested. We've got a small role for you. Promising me not much, don't work, just come on in and have a good time with us. Every page of the script, Jim's in it. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Yeah, yeah. And, 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 I, and I gotta say, I, we went to see. I that. was the lighting guy in the show. He was. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Oh, That's what I thought was funny. Was it? Uh, but it is. Uh, it, it was a wonderful play. Jim did a great job, and you're you were at you tried out again, and you made you made the cut the second yeah. time. And this is more of a courtroom drama, right? You know, the, you're the 12 Angry Men Absolutely, classic yeah. play sure. and a movie with sure. I mean, Henry Fonda and a bunch of famous folks in the black mm -hmm. and white film. Well, we're doing a little twist on 12 Angry Men. It's 12 incompetent jurors. <laughs> and there is a case that is, it should be settled. There's no question what's going on. We can't come to a consensus and it's nutty and mm. crazy. And I'm juror number three. All right. How fun. From lighting guy to juror number three. You're moving up in the world. <laughs> you have. You have moved So Shakespeare in the fall. Right? <laughs> Shakespeare in the fall. Yeah. Great. So, no, the reason I bring that up is, Why did is you again, that? this is that element of stress relief. And I know it can be stressful. Yeah. But that, that need to do something beyond what our jobs are, beyond stuff at home. We need that creative release or something. And, and the doctors will tell you all the time, find something you love. And do it. That's right. Because, right because health-wise, it is so important to get whatever it is out of your brain for a while and just go with, sure. just relax. And and yes, it can be stressful, but it's that kind of stress you that, that it helps me? you grow. I don't know about you guys. The prep time. Yeah. Step out. And the entertainment side is fun. Yes. Yeah. Then you go yes. back in the back room again. I got to go out again. Mm -hmm. It's 
you do if you like that or you like this or you like cooking what like you said you feel what good when you're doing it right yeah when I'm on that show in the morning I love you people coming on and talking to you yeah when I'm waiting to go on okay what time is it is it 7 27 is it, is it yeah. 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 then you go and the lights on you go I get that stress relief. I never thought of that. Allison's the same way with her events that, that she has. Oh, she we, must we, be wonderful. Yeah, yeah um, she does great events, and and they're uh, they, everybody loves attending them. The doctors love and and providers love being uh-huh. there. But yeah, she's kind of a nervous wreck up until that moment. She, walk, yeah. she yeah. walks out yes. in front and she's yes. like, "Hi everybody, yeah. welcome to." And boom, she's got you know, it's fo- it's go time. It's focus. Yeah, so. but you know, even even this, I got to make sure that I got the measurements. Got to get it together. Got to get it. Well, we right were before watching that. before we started. You were yeah. nervous, was, Nelly, over here. <laughs> Actually, I'm eat that uh, Jeff, right well, now that's we, we're dealing can with we two. Use these? We're, we're dealing with two because we're going to dive into them after we're done. After he put his hands in there, yes, I got sir. the top one. <laughs> <laughs> you got the top one. So this is going to be the no bake breakfast energy bar. So okay. I'm going to need. One of you gentlemen to throw in okay. the Rice Krispie Treats. There is Wait, the four this? cups. Yes, sir. How much of this is it? The there? whole we thing. Have to grab oh, the whole thing goes in. Do you need to do more with that, or are they ready? Um, they sh- well, good to go? I, they're good to do. Yeah, they're good. So put yeah. your Rice Krispies in. Yep. Look and at then we need the um, uh, the dried cranberries. Would you like to do that one? Oh, I'll do the, the dried cranberries. Give us the dried cranberries. And they are good. Yeah. I've tasted a couple. I'm so good. <laughs> So glad they're good. All right. So right. then, we're, what we're going to do is we're going to take that and we're going to give it a good mix. And then right in the here. small, yes, sir. And the small bowl, we're going to do the one cup of peanut butter, the honey, the coconut oil, and vanilla extract. Why don't you guys handle that all mix? Okay. There and we go. Doing the peanut butter. All right. And when I wait, see, they're mixing up very nicely right there. As I lose it, no, no, on the table yet. Okay, after the peanut this butter, is pretty what do you have? Stuff going. It you is have, really you simple. You have the honey, which is over there. Well, honey? Yeah, okay. honey. Oh, look at them between the two gentlemen calling me honey. Isn't that sweet? <laughs> Never again, Jen. Just remember, say I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not doing this with her again. I'm busy. <laughs> oh. Oh, How thank sweet. you, honey. Honey. Oh. Oh, man. So we added in the well, honey, half a that, cup of honey. Now there's some coconut oil in this. There is coconut oil. Right, that, that brings a lot. That does bring What's some other oil? other. Uh, don't try it right out of the bowl. <laughs> <laughs> it uh, it does bring some some here. flavor to yeah. this. There are a lot of uh, some okay. of the the extra nutrients and uh, ooh, other sort of still things. Still very simple. It is. Yeah. yeah. Coconut oil is really good for you. Well, and the saturated fat level is low on it. If I if I remember, it's bubbling there, John. Almost. Hey, we're almost there. Almost All right, there. good. Yeah. What are you putting in? Oh, okay. So after What's the that sitting there. What's that? That's that is vanilla. that is the uh, vanilla. Okay, vanilla. The vanilla is that going in. in. Look at that. Oh, I love vanilla. You know what? On these bars, it's going to be delicious. Sure. I'm excited. Okay. So, all right. So now, after we mix all of that in, yeah, pretty thoroughly. Use mix. spatula and mix this. Well, we put this in. You got to mix this first. Yep. Oh, Give here, it a good we'll mix. swap. We'll swap and let you mix that. Let me put that I'll down. Take it. Oh, you got it. Yes, sir. You know what? Look at you. You you mean business. You're coming in and little Jimmy homemaker. <laughs> <laughs> so they call me off studio. <laughs> uh, we are after this today. Will... <laughs> oh, this will be in my private collection. Okay, here we go. Look at that. Okay, right. I want to dig into that right now. I this know. is going in. Yes, yep, sir. Going right in. Like I've done this before. You are looking like you've done this before. Oh, man. Look at that. Come on. Get every little bit yeah, out of Yeah, you it's bet. Look at that. Okay. And you know what? I think I think now, that does help. Yes. The turn. Yep, up. yep. Oh, this is going to be the fun part. Yeah. Oh, I let the muscles do that. John? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. Okay, gentlemen, our eggs are getting done here. Would anybody like cheese on the top of their eggs? A little tiny would be good. Yes, that would be good. A little yes. tiny bit? I'm in the middle there somewhere, I think. Okay. We'll just You're do a little better, bit of Jim. cheese. It's, uh, it's mixed nuts, Jim. We, we, Jim is also... Wait, Jim also does... That's for that. That's right? for that. Okay, yeah, that's yeah. for that. Yeah. So we have, uh, again, more movie references. Mixed nuts. We have coconuts. Coconuts. Yeah. <laughs> Coconuts, yeah, oh, you got it. So, no, the Marx Brothers. The Marx Brothers. Oh, the coconuts. Sure. Oh, 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 o
Yeah, I think it's all gummed up on the... No, no, look it. I've got it flipped over. There it is. That's good. No, what's going to happen is when we bake this, it, yeah. will, it will... I'm sorry, when, when we put it in the refrigerator, it'll smooth out. I think we're kind of there. All right. How'd those do? You got to cook a little more? Got to cook just right, a little yeah. bit more. We're going to get that cheese melted, and then we're done. All right. One more. I think we're there. I'm not eating that one. No, don't. Don't worry about that. There's no five-second rule for that. It seems to be about there. All right. We're pretty well mixed here. Yeah. All right. So now we've got a pan with the parchment paper. We're just going John, to... John, or you want to do that part? I sure. will dump it straight down there. Oh, okay. Let me help you hold it. Thank you. Thank you. Sure. And honestly, why do you want to throw the parchment on there just to remind people that don't cook a lot? Why is that down there? You know what? Actually, it helps with it sticking to yeah, the pan. That's what I thought. You can actually just take it right out of the pan and flip but, it over onto something, rip off the parchment paper, and, okay. and cut it up from there. Yeah. It makes it so much so you're easier. You kind of flat it out to the pan. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So just make it the size that the thickness that you would like your bars to be when we That's one good bar up. for me in the morning. Is that right? You know what? It, honestly, it some makes days you're hungry. hungry. That's yeah, right. Yeah. Or some days you need some more. Hangry. That's the Snickers bar, there right? We're go. darn close. We got the peanut butter. I don't have any sponsorships. So the one with the nuts and chocolate new. We won't say the name of what it is, but no sponsors yet. I'm over here snickering about that. Yeah, we are snickering about it, sure. So yeah, then, yeah, Jim, we, we did talk a little bit about. I'm sorry, Allison, go ahead. I, I was just going to say that's all right. We're going to put this in the freezer Ooh. and let it sit for just a little bit till it hardens and kind of, um, you know. Just makes a nice bar. Is it bar. fighting you there a little bit? Or are we okay? You know You're what? It, I think it's the operator. It could be the oh. operator. I'm just going to be honest. Oh, oh. <laughs> right. You're good, Allison. All right. There it goes. In the freezer. In the good. freezer we In go. The freezer. That's a lot of nice stuff. Really, really healthy, yeah. really a lot of protein. Um, you're getting your nappy, Ooh, your bubbles, healthy fats. Bubbles. Yep, yep. We're getting there. So, uh, Jim, we were talking about the, uh, the snacks and things that mm -hmm. we eat and everything. Uh, I mean, it's... it's both of us are getting older. Mm -hmm. All three of us are getting older, let's be honest. Thanks Two for of leaving us. me that out of that Two at first. Us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, so how, but it's important that we focus on nutrition as we get older because, you know, when we were kids, I mean, we probably ate anything we wanted and it didn't matter. For a little while, yeah. 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 But health-wise, I mean, as we get older, that's obviously something I'm, I've been focused on. I, I recently had my uh, colonoscopy that I was supposed mm -hmm. to have several years ago that I, because of COVID and other things I just now had. Good report coming out of that. Good. It was good that I did it because I found out there were some potential health problems Ooh. that aren't. But he said, uh, you know, hey, you need to come back sooner rather than, you okay. know, wait, don't wait 10 years to do this. You need to come back sooner. And I'm okay. like, absolutely. I want to know what's going on. Right. And other than, the, you know, the prep and all the getting ready for it and everything, I'm glad I did it. You know, because I did find out stuff. But I know you've dealt with some health, health issues as well, not to get into those. But yeah. as we get older, we deal with these things that we took for granted when we were younger. Well, because the metabolism uh, was up there in the 19s and 20s and whatever, and all of a sudden found myself, I will say, two years ago, almost 90 pounds heavier than I am today. Mm. And again, it's taken a little bit of, I'm not saying that for what, if I, I used to not be able to reach my back, but you know, not for that. It's the idea of, with my ACMC doctor, who I've been with for years, trying to get me to do good things, I was in pain all the time. My joints were hurting all the time. I was over, I was well overweight, and we talked about how to do some things and how to change a few things, and protein more, mm -hmm. junky stuff that I look. Face it, you like it too. We all like we it. All we're do. Americans. Right. We like right. some of these things. And it, you, the thing is, I learned, unless it's a health risk. You don't have to say no to everything. I found portions is what changed mm. for me. Absolutely. Yeah. I now so don't eat everything yeah. I want to eat. I eat what I want to eat in smaller stuff. Yeah. Oh, that's great. That's made a difference for me. Still more healthy than it was, but I would say other than the choice I made to give dairy up, that was my own choice. I used to drink milk all the time. Sure. Just, I just did it. Mm. But foods, my wife and I enjoy the foods that we eat together or if we go out. I just find I'm not putting away as much as I did before, and that's made a major difference. Besides, I do more biking now, which oh, I didn't wow. before. It's like a stationary fine, bike thing for, because of my knees. I had a knee replaced three years ago oh. Oh, this October. It's been that long. Wow. If you hardly know, I hardly know that happened because it feels so good now. Because you're much healthier. Compared to before. Sure. But, you know, you got to make some changes. So these little healthy things <clears> that they're trying to show you, little snacks or meals, 
it does become important as you age. It really does. It does. It does. Yeah. One Dr. Of the Williams things, is trying to work with me. Dr. Williams is fantastic. I do make her earn her money, way. that's for sure. <laughs> But she's well, a great doc. She is a great doc. She just had two wonderful babies. I heard that. So, yeah, everybody in Conneaut is celebrating. When you go into the Conneaut Health Center, it says, uh, it's a boy. Oh, they have how it cute. Up in there, so everybody who comes Have they mixed them up yet that we know? Not that we know. Not that I heard there was an A and B somewhere. There's an A and B on the hat, so they, they know, yeah, which one is I love which. That. So, yeah. Dr. Williams is very whole, whole holistical, whole body health, and she's just fantastic. But you know what I find with her? I talk to her other than right now, once a month, she's on, and then I have somebody else on later in the month. Everybody that goes on to her, like mostly probably Connie out of that area, they love Dr. Williams. They do. Yeah. I hear I hear that back. I have nothing to do with the hospital other than have her on. The, con the stuff I hear, they really like her. You know what I like? She talks to me about a health topic every month, and I know what she's talking about. I don't go, what did she say when we're all done? Did I get that? She, yeah. I get it. Yeah. Yeah. Very interesting. Just you have great doctors out here. You know what? Thank one you. thing Thank I will say about Dr. Williams um, that I'll never forget. She did an event for me um, and somebody raised their hand and they said, how do I look like you? Because she's fit. She's yeah. she's very healthy. She's got muscles. Energetic. And somebody said, yes. They said, how do I look like you? And you know what she said? She said, if it tastes good, don't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that blew my theory right out of the water. But no, right, I get right. it. She would say that. But she yeah. would. You know, and joking aside, yeah. you know, everything's in moderation. And go. another thing that she did say is eat what portions you should be eating, what you think you should be eating, you know, this mm -hmm. And you think you're hungry. Walk away from the plate for a couple of minutes and let all of that sit. And then you're going to see you're satisfied. You know, that's one of the things they taught me is the idea of I, I everything I do is I do it pretty quickly. I, I eat quickly so you eat, yes. take more in than you're really hungry for because you just keep eating it yes. quickly. Because you don't feel that you're full. Slow, I slowed it down. Yes. And I, I it took a bit. You have to change things. But mm -hmm. I am now fuller on less food because I just, I learned to take my time a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. Good advice. Absolutely. Well, I, I'm done taking time with this water over here. Is this so enough? It's, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's good enough. All right, so let's go so ahead and, do? and dump, the, dump the oats in there. In here? Yep. You want me to? Oh, Lord. We're not the, not the nuts. No, 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 not the nuts. Why the am I? Okay, so these are almonds. You see how much in the kitchen? Yeah, these are almonds. Oh, that's oats. Almonds. So, almonds. Oats. Oats. We learned something today. <laughs> Is that better? All right, yeah, yeah. yeah and then, then we're going to go ahead and add some salt to that. I'm going to let you. Uh, hey, how yeah, here, here's how you do this, okay? I'm going to let you. I'm going to let you do this, okay? So you, you hold out your hand. That's yeah. about that's about a teaspoon. Okay. So, I, but I'm going to let you do it. So you, now your hand's a little bit bigger than mine. So you just do. do that's good. How's right that? Yeah, that's good right there. Boom. Or should I say? Bam! Bam! That's right. There you go. Now go ahead and oh, turn that down. Yes, Jim, sir. go ahead and, if you don't mind, turn that down so the knob is pointing toward the bottom. There we go. Like that? Yep, that's good. Stir it up just a little bit. That's good. Now we're going to cook this for about, well, the sudden part we sloshed over, we're going to cook this for about five minutes. <laughs> I didn't mean to. It's all right. You know what, Jim? You told us before you came on here that this was going to be... Uh, something that you don't normally do, and you are absolutely doing. I have to look bad on the camera. Summer, I'll be cooking at home all the time now. <laughs> <laughs> well, we might come visit you on Sunrise Live with all of our yeah, stuff and make it for I, us. I, I will say you have to be. This is with this hot pot, uh, hot pot thing the way it is. Right. Uh, you have to be a little careful that those don't fall off. Are we you? good? So, yeah. yeah, I'm in the middle, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's bubbling. Oh, it's bubbling now. Look at that hot pot. That's look at it. Yeah, it's bubbling, it's bubbling now. Yeah, We're cooking. It's so, a hot plate. Hot plate. Hot Thank plate. you. Yeah, hot plate. Oh, so yeah, if you need to hold it down there, so we got about four minutes left on that. Oh my! I think it's two minutes. These the quick oats are two minutes. Oh, those are two minutes. Yep. All right, I'm following the recipe. That's okay. Well, it, it looks it looks like it's almost done anyway. Oh, yeah. look at those bubbles. Yeah. yeah. It smells pretty good. It does. Yeah. Can you guys smell that? It's good. Gotcha. Wow. <laughs> Smell of vision. Smell of vision. <laughs> what do we have to do with this now at this point? All right, we're going to add the bananas, the peanut butter, and. Uh, and I'll stand out of the way here and keep going while you guys keep going. Okay. We How have much of all this are you putting both so we bananas have, in? It calls for both bananas. All right, go ahead, drop those in there. Look at that. I don't want to splash yet. No, we're good. Okay. Ow! No, we're good. Oh. <laughs> Did I scare you a little bit? We're good. Just a bit. Al Roker, watch out. I'm coming That's for you. That's right. Coming for the job. What is it? Good morning, America. What was he on? I don't know. It doesn't matter anymore. It doesn't matter anymore. It doesn't matter anymore. Sunrise Live with Jim.
Because <laughs> you'll need to scoop that in there. Oh, okay. All right. Peanut butter, more protein. Look mm-hmm. at that going right in. Look at that. Take wow, it. I'm speaking of movies. Yeah. All right. Oh, gosh, right. that's an oldie, but I believe it. Steve McQueen was in that movie, by the way. Yeah. The original Bob. Hmm. Did you know that? I did not know He was that. a very popular star back then, but he was one of his first movies before he was famous. Wow. Well, so, little trivia you learned today. All right, almonds. Almonds. Oh, those are almonds. Mm-hmm. Almonds, oats, almonds, oh. oats. <laughs> uh, now, you can sweeten this if you want to with agave syrup. Ooh. Or leave it the way it is. How would you guys do it? Well, you know the bananas are sweet already. Yeah. So if uh, there's two ways you could do it. One, you could you could put the agave in there to sweeten it. But um, a lot of people, especially if you're trying to eat healthy, you learn that you don't meal without. Uh, any sweet extras, yeah. Okay. yeah. You know, because I grew up eating oatmeal. You know, the little pouches of oatmeal, right. instant oatmeal, right. things like that. And and as I got older, I would eat more pouches for breakfast up. because you need more and everything. Well, I found out I'm getting all this sugar and extra all this stuff. stuff. Yeah, that I don't really need. So I've learned to appreciate oatmeal without too much sweetening. Yeah. And those those um, uh, bananas will really sweeten that. Right over here. If you want to, yeah. okay. if you really want to make sure that the bananas make the whole thing sweet. You kind of mush them up a little bit. A little you bit. I had a stir of it, but yeah. I didn't crunch them. Okay. Yeah, no, I think that's good. I, and I think, I think that is the thing, is yeah. when you put the fruit in there, it, yeah. it gives you your sweetener. It's, it's got, you know, your yeah. natural Guys, sugars. Look at that. And, yeah, mm. now, it says that if it's too thick, you could put milk, almond. I think almond milk would be good in that okay. because you get that. Al- got you've already almond. got okay. the almonds in there. Yeah. You could put any kind of uh, dairy substitute that you prefer Oat in that. milk, almond milk. Yeah. Yeah. Anything like that, you can add into it. And All right. So, uh, and so we've got that. We've got the. Oh, you've got your stuff in here. We are. We're gonna give it a. Well, look know. at those babies. How they do? They look like they did very well. Maybe not. I noticed the ones in the middle look the most delicious, but I mean that's just my opinion. <laughs> Maybe, maybe, that's hot, because, maybe, maybe that's because you put them together. Medic, June. medic. We, hey, we know a good doctor. We know a good doctor. Yeah. We know a couple good doctors. They look good. Wow. So we, one, we, one we, somebody things. got the fluffy ones over yeah. there. <laughs> so we put a little bit of cheese on the top yeah. to get it nice and brown. Look at that. The tomatoes. Uh, like I love that color. A little bit. Yeah. It just looks good. It does yeah. look. It, and they are. They're really fantastic. Healthy, fantastic. You can put the broccoli. You can put the cauliflower, spinach, tomatoes, yes, whatever you want in there. Yes, we could have, yes. but, but we didn't. So. <laughs> well, what I'm looking for. And that should, was pretty. Should easy. we cut one of those open easy. and look inside that? Yeah, yeah, take, take the big one there. Take the nice fluffy yeah, one. Okay. Oh, are we ready to get the egg? Ba- the uh, sure. Out? Sure. All right. Let's see how that do. Oh, look at that is nice and fluffy and cut in there. What do you see in there? What'd you put in there? That's yours, I think. Uh, is this? I think, I think this these, are these two Johns? Oh, okay. Yeah. What'd you put in there, Jen? I put uh, peppers, some of the I onions, see on top. and okay. tomatoes, and uh, the cheese. All right. And so we've got steam coming out of there. Steam coming out Boy, of there. They're all in there. Yep, and it's fantastic. Ooh. So do we want to take this out? Uh, we Probably not. Uh, it's no. not quite yet. Look at that. Norm- normally, you'd leave this in for 20 to 30 minutes, and okay. you, would, you would chill it in the refrigerator a little bit longer just to make sure that that peanut butter and everything melts together. And then you can cut it into like the energy size bar, you know. Oh, yeah. Energy bar things that we, we all know and love. I want to cut into this. And you know what? I would, I would not recommend eating all of this together because it, no. it, it's a lot. But to make one of these, put nice little servings in those cups. Absolutely, and these are great to freeze. Oh, put them, uh, okay. You can freeze them, Free and then you could just heat them up, or um, put them in the fridge for a couple of days, and you can take them on the go if you need to have a quick breakfast, quick lunch, or when you're watching Sunrise Live with Jim in the morning. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that! They're so, all there. That's yeah, all they're so they're out. Yep. Yeah, that oh. needs to be that needs to be cold for a while. Yeah, yeah. 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 that needs to we get the a little bit longer, but yeah. everything in there. But again, look look at the color that's in each of these. There's a little bit of color. And I was always taught color is it means it's healthier. It's variety. It's taste. It's flavor. So you've got the peppers over here, the onions, the egg, the cheese. You've got the bananas, the almonds, mm-hmm. the oatmeal obviously brings some flavor to it. And then look at all those everything, nuts and yeah. peanut butter yeah. and everything else. So. You know what? I would love to put dried cranberries in that, though. We should do that. We that should do really that. In the oatmeal. I will, yeah. I, will, I will cook that in sometimes to get that flavor so it goes all throughout. But mix raisins and onions in, or not onions, raisins and cranberries in. Oh, yeah. 
It's very tasty. You're right. Absolutely. That's a perfect yeah. addition to that. Bananas and cranberries. That's that look how easy that was. All three yeah. of these. Yeah, done. very, very easy, delicious, healthy. Protein, protein, protein is what, you know, cardiologists say, your primary care, they say protein is key to weight loss, to staying healthy. Um, so, you know, I, I hate to say this, guys, as much as I'm having a really nice time with you, I think we need to end this so we can eat. What do you think? I'm ready. Well, all right. I'll try some of this. <laughs> I was just, I I I was just thinking, keep, I keep talking, Alice, and I'm going to reach in here and, and then I'll start tasting the food. Yeah. Right. Thank you so much for coming on. It's nice to have you in our neck of the woods because you have us over <laughs> there fun. all the time. And you, I love you the connection us. we have Yeah, and the collaboration. Absolutely, absolutely. And I told Jim earlier when I go out in the community, everybody says, I saw you on Sunrise Live with Jim this morning. So it's kind one of, of my eight have you. viewers. Yes. Um, many, many more than That's that. Wonderful. You're our, Thank you. You're our celebrity. It's you're always our, fun. Our, this is fun. Yes. We love having you up for Thank our you. It really is. Yeah, absolutely. Appreciate it. Yep. Well, thanks for being with us. If you if you would like to make an appointment with any of our docs, what's our phone number? 440-997-6969. Every wow. time he knows Every it. I didn't know I was time. doing that either. He did not. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> this is how much we count on, Jim. <laughs> so thanks for joining us um, at ACMC's Wellness Kitchen. We are happy to have you. All of the recipes will be linked down below. Okay. Cool. Leave a comment or any questions. If you have them, we'll try to get back to you and answer those if we can. Um, again, thanks for coming to join us. Thanks for joining me all the Absolutely. time and being my... Be in my... I'll be on that side soon enough. I know. <laughs> Next time, John will be behind the camera. Okay, right. That's right. Thank you for inviting me. Anytime. We'd love to have you back. And like I said, if you have to make an appointment or if you need anything from us, just reach out. We're happy to help you in any way we can.